Earthquakes are vibrations caused by earth movement at plate boundaries and at fault lines. So the two plate boundaries that uh, most commonly have earthquakes are converging boundaries and transverse boundaries. So with a converging boundary, we've got two plates that are converging. They're moving towards each other. And often this happens where we've got uh, an oceanic plate, which is a lot thinner than a continental plate. So the continental plate's thicker, the oceanic plate is thinner, and it tends to move underneath the, uh, the continental plate. And the transverse plate boundary, we've got the two plates that actually slide past each other. So one moves in this direction and one moves in that direction. And a fault line is an area of fracture of the Earth's surface. So it's, it's a weakness in the Earth's surface, um, a fracture line. So a fault is a fracture or crack in the crust. Now, uh, the way that earthquakes occur is a model that we call a stick and slip. Might do it up here. Stick and slip. Okay, so what happens is that um, the plates are jagged. They, or the fault lines, etc. They're, they're, they're jagged pieces of rock. They're not allowed to slide over each other easily. So what tends to happen is that the plates are pushing against each other and they stick. When they're sticking there, the pressure is building up as the plates are trying to move, but they can't move because they're stuck. So the pressure is just building up and up and up until the, the fault gives way and there's a slip. So the the, it builds up, the pressure builds up, and then finally it slips and gives way. And at that point, that's when the vibration occurs and the earthquake occurs. So the stick is the pressure build up, and there's no movement, and it's stuck. And then the slip is when it gives way, and there's movement, and then of course the vibration of the earthquake. So the movement causes the, the vibration of the earth and, and the earthquake to occur. So here's our two plates or our fault line. This is where the earthquake is going to occur. So the earthquake doesn't occur on the surface, it occurs somewhere down in the earth's crust. And um, that the po actual point where the earthquake occurs has got a name and that's called the focus. The actual place of the earthquake is called the focus. The place where the rock slips and the vibration starts is called the focus. Now, you probably haven't heard that term before, but one I'm sure you've heard is that directly above this on the surface of the earth is what we call the epicenter of the earthquake. So the epicenter is the place on the surface directly above the focus. And the focus is the location of the earthquake. And the focus is the location of the earthquake.